Guys, everybody has that one video that they really hope is going to, you know, take off and it's going to help them make it on social media and on YouTube, especially in my case. So right now I'm hoping this is the video. There's a little bit of clickbait, a lot of bit of clickbait, let's be real. But as you can see here, I posted it. So I posted it three minutes ago. Obviously it's the video you guys watched yesterday. So in three minutes, it's got two views. Excellent. Two views, amazing. But because of the nature of the video, I surprised my mom with the new car. You know, everyone who watches the video in totality will obviously see that, you know, my mom paid for the car, but we just took her there and basically, theoretically surprised her. So we weren't lying, but I'm really hoping that this video, due to its clickbait nature, can really help me get more views. What I'm actually gonna do is I'm going to put in brackets over there I'm gonna put in brackets and say not clickbait because it's not clickbait we did surprise her with the new car but the new car was hers that she paid but hopefully this video takes off so I don't know when last I actually did a video where I showed tracks obviously if you follow me on Instagram then you would have seen tracks but this dog has grown so he's lying here in the study we always have to put down something we always have to put down something for him to lie on but here he is Bro, he's massive. He's a big dog. Let me lie down next to him and maybe we can get a comparison to see how big he is as opposed to me. This dog has grown. Hey. Look at him. He's massive. He's almost the same size as the table. Okay, let's go check in on Sasha. Let's go check in on the lady that is going to be going on stage in today's Tuesday. You guys will be seeing this on Wednesday. So she's been going on stage in 10 days. She's currently in obviously the strictest part of prep and currently cooking some egg whites. The, is this one of the most enjoyable meals of the day or not? Because you get yeah. avo. Avo is nice. Remember oh, that's nice. My favorite is the rice and the mince. Yeah, that is our post-workout meal. We carbs. When we get carbs, so we get carbs now pre-workout and post-workout. Still eating enough carbs. Sasha pre-workout is having 40 grams of oats, peanut butter, and um, what's that other thing called? Whey protein, TNT. And then now, cooking up over there, we've got, these are some peppers. Peppers. And garlic. Garlic, oh, I can smell it. Actually, it smells really good. And then in her egg white, she's gonna add some spinach, and then avo and one rice cake. So, if you guys love um, what's that stuff called, avo on toast, oh. you will really like. Even though obviously it's not it's not as nice as avo on toast, but avo on a rice cake, it satisfies cravings for at least myself, and I know it does for Sasha. So let's see your end product and hopefully Master Chef over here makes a great omelette. Here is the famous rice cake and avo. Measuring it, getting that accuracy, making sure that you stay on track. Got five grams. Five grams left. I will get those five grams. That's the difficult thing about dieting because let's say you slice an avo in half over here. If half of the avo is 55 grams, Bro, you don't have those five grams. 47. So oh, that yes. means there's 48 grams in that half. You can either slice and get some more out of there, or you can take from here. See, that's where the little, the little small decisions you make in life to maybe just count exactly, you know, 50 grams. You don't go too over, you don't go too below, and you make sure that you stick to it, you stick to the plan, and you know, the results 100% will show. The egg whites over here. That master chef has been done nicely. So how many egg whites there? Six. Six egg whites. Spinach, red peppers and yellow peppers. Salt, Himalayan salt only. And then some herbs. Sweet basil, cayenne pepper, great thermogenic. Are you feeling ready for a show? Yeah, kind of, 50-50. So Sasha has reduced her calories. We pretty much reduce it by like 100 calories per week, which makes it manageable. I'm currently on quite a, a low amount of calories. I am on 1,800 calories. That is probably the second lowest I will go. What's going on here? Sasha's busy studying here. There's a monkey riding. It's a baboon. 
riding That's, another one. It's a baby monkey. Yo, I thought it was Kylo. Kylo. That's the thing, this dog sleeps in the washroom over here because he knows that's where he gets his food. Exactly. Are you still allowed to have some Coke Zero? Yeah, she's still allowed Coke Zero. We only stop, you know, preservatives, artificial sweeteners, those kind of stuff from 10 days out. You know that's tomorrow, right? So now it's my turn to eat, bro. It is now 12 o'clock. I last ate, I think it was about half past six last night, so pretty much an 18 hour fast. Wait, let me actually think about it. So here is my meal. Got 10 egg whites. It's only 170-ish calories. There was supposed to be enough avo, but there's only 30 grams of avo there, it's 35 grams. Got some asparagus I did in the air fryer, and then just some red peppers. What are you training, bro? Scholars. Askis? Shoulders. <laughs> I got an English following, not Afrikaans following, so we don't understand. No one Afrikaans follows me. You don't know that. I've seen many Tians in it. That's so stereotypical. My name's Jessie. You are half Afrikaans. So exactly, you yeah, my name's Jessie. I've got an English female name, but I'm Afrikaans. Snowflake caught in her lashes. She was ready to let go. 